What's up guys, this is Cody here with iPhoneHacks.com and today I'm going to be showing you a new tweak that just hit Cydia called AppTray. Now AppTray is going to add another tab to your notification center and allow you to add the specified apps that you want so you have quick access to all your applications just by swiping down on the notification center. So you can see here that there's a brand new tab right there called AppTray and it automatically opens up to AppTray when I swipe down. Now that's a setting that you can change in the settings but we'll get into that in just a second. So you can see here that if I just tap on the app it's obviously going to open right up and you can access all your apps just with a swipe down. So it's actually pretty cool. So let's jump into the settings here and I'm going to scroll down to the AppTray settings and you have a kill switch right here you also have a toggle where you can enable or disable this to open directly to the app tray so you can see like I was saying before opens directly to it if you turn it off it's gonna open up to a different tab you can also change the icon opacity right here so let's just put it a little bit down and let's turn this back on and you can see the icons have a little transparency to them and also down here this is where you're going to uh, select the applications that you want in app tray so if we take these off and let's say we just want to add the app store calculator clock and compass so then when we swipe down oh, it looks like we got some more down here let's turn those off and obviously no respring is required for any of this you just have to swipe down and it's automatically changed now another really cool thing about this is I'm not a big fan of the today or miss tab so I like to use NC all only well this tweak actually works with NC all only as you can see right there you have all your notifications right here and then you have your app tray right there on the right hand side so even if you use NC all only this tweak is gonna work for you so let me know what you guys think about this tweak in the comments below and if you enjoyed this video please hit that like button if you want to see more of my videos then go ahead and subscribe Alright guys, until next time, this is Cody with iPhoneHacks.com.